think it's funny. Other people are like, I'm watching Roseanne right now. See, if YouTube's down, you could always turn on television. Who remembers television? You guys remember that? That used to be a thing. There used to be this, there used to be newspapers. There used to be television. Remember the, all that shit? In all seriousness, though, analog television. You know what? I, you know what the thing is that got me to really stop watching television. In, in all honesty, um, the thing that got me to stop watching television. I mean, I'll watch it once in a blue moon, but I really don't watch TV anymore. It's fucking back in the day. You used to be able to. There I go again with back in the day. You used to be able to have the remote control in your hand, and you could go through the channels really, really, really fast. And because it was like analog, I guess, and then it was like, blah, 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 blah. I could go through like 100, whatever, 100 channels in like 10 seconds. And if you, all I needed was just that flash frame of what's on TV and be like, blah, 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 blah. you know, just go through the channels real quick. Then they made it all digital. And it's the worst fucking thing ever. You have to have that fucking guide that goes, uh, that's slow as shit. And then you go down, go down, you go down, or the search thing, and it's just, it's the slowest fucking thing ever. And you select the channel, and then, then it loads. It's like such shit. It's so bad. Oh my god, those commercials too. And people are saying too many commercials. Well, commercial, I mean, commercials, for one thing, even back then though, in the... 80s and 90s. Com commercials, I liked watching commercials. I liked the old McDonald's commercials and stuff like that. And if you have a television show, see, now I understand. As a, as a kid, I didn't understand, like, I hated it. I was like, okay, I just want to watch fucking DuckTales or something. And then, oh God, the goddamn commercials going on. Well, I wanted to see what was going to happen with Magical Dispel. Is fucking Uncle Scrooge going to get his lucky dime back or not? You know, and then it cuts to a commercial, and you're like, God damn it! You know, what do we got? Fruit stripe gum commercial. But the commercials back then used to be so good. It was almost like, okay, well, I could watch the commercials back then. But the thing is, if you didn't have the commercials, you wouldn't have the show, because the commercials pay for the show. So I can put up with commercials. What I can't put up with is that I can't flip through the fucking channels like fast anymore it drives me fucking crazy you would think because it's a computer it would go faster you know it, but it's fucking it goes slower commercials were made way more charming not for the stupid sake of it big bang theory still uses laugh tracks it's so fake sounding <laughs> man laugh tracks I stopped watching TV because there's nothing on it that I want. Yeah, oh, that's the other reason. There's nothing fucking on. It's a very slow computer, yeah. Zakan75 says, What happened to watching good old nature? Well, you could, you could watch Bob Ross, you know. Uh, Duo says, I miss TV Guide. Oh my god, TV Guide was so good. You know what? Somewhere around, I have to find it. But um, you guys know how I do the show and tell things on stream. I have the old Star Trek TV Guides, and I could show you guys. Uh, I could show you guys there, them, those one, one night. It's like Patrick Stewart or whatever on the front cover of TV Guide and all those. I have like all those fucking TV Guides from back, from back then. TV Guide was the shit back then. TV Guide, man. Fucking TV Guide is awesome. There used to be like funny little blurbs in there and shit, and like in the in the beginning of it, there was like little articles and I don't know. It was good back when there was magazines and all that shit. I mean, I guess there still is all that, but it's like it's just different. Because now with the internet, it's like you can just read the internet, so there's no real need to buy the magazines. You know? Where back then, it was you were more likely to buy them because there wasn't really an alternative. So I guess that's the difference, even though they're, they're still around. Technically. Uh, 
TV commercials used to be so good. This Bud's for you. Oh, I, yeah, I remember this This Bud's for you and all that. And um, I used to have a glass of, what's his name? Uh, um, uh, Spuds McKenzie. Yeah, anybody, you guys remember fucking Spuds McKenzie? Man, that was, I guess that was like early, mid 80s, right? Uh, I'm, I'm dating myself just a little bit, but not as much as when I get on the Laurel and Hardy subject in a few minutes. Ha ha! We've been talking about that a lot lately. And uh, Glenn Miller, we're gonna start talking about Glenn Miller again. My chat loves when I when I talk about that shit. I start seeing my viewers like drop. In fact, <laughs> in fact, I just looked up. It went from like 4:22 to 4:19 in the last <laughs> like like two seconds. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh my god. That's what all the kids are talking about today. I, I'm really good at getting people to, to leave my my chat room. <laughs> oh my god, just start talking about uh, Jack Benny and people people flee. Run for the hills. Head for the hills, boy! He's talking about the little rascals again! <laughs> Shit. I'm sitting here talking about whatever the fuck I'm talking about because I don't want people to totally tune. If I if I just sat here and didn't speak, that probably wouldn't be, that'd be a totally different type of stream. Um, I have a lot of people in my chat. So, you know, some people say like, just focus on the game and don't fuck, don't fuck. God damn it. See, I, maybe I should be focusing on the game. <laughs> maybe those people are right. <laughs> oh, shit.